How's the belly button looking now? Still, it's kind of breaking apart now. It's not so rigid, so this area is kind of, but it still has that diamond shape, you know? So the four quadrants. Then what's the next technique? I'm going around from the outside. Body. Slowly spiraling in. Yeah. But what I'm doing is I'm feeling for pockets like air bubbles, like the bubble wrap that you get in parcels. Feeling for that kind of sensation. So with Jeanette, I have to use a little bit more pressure. Just that's just the way it is. And when I feel a pocket of, uh, of something, I actually learn more counter-rotate, like I'm unscrewing. One finger on top of the other, until I feel it dispersing. Does this remind you of something? Because the fascia can tangle, like you've heard I've got knots in my stomach physically can have a knot in your stomach. That restricts blood flow, restricts nerve involvement from the conventional sense, blah, over time. These are these blockages these monks were working on, they were feeling for this sense of just something that doesn't, is not. How I know I'm reaching one is when I'm moving my hand, I can feel like the restriction, my, my finger can't move any further. I, I root around. Janet doesn't have that. She's a pretty cool person. Cool, keep them low. This is what country living does for you. Yeah, it's yeah. Work. Yeah. So actually now, as I come closer, so I've created a spiral. I've been judging what I feel if there's block blockages around these areas. And I've been slowly working my way in. And actually the majority of these <coughs> nodules are around Janet's belly button itself. What would that be in Shiatsu around the belly button? It's green. Ah, very good. So now I'm getting, a, I've got three correlations. And this is important for you, you need to know that you're moving in the right direction with her treatment. Yes? Diagnosis, remember, is what differentiates us from massage people. Do you want to feel that, just very gently? See if you can go around and see if you can feel what I'm feeling. I have to be careful when I'm breaking the wall. Just use your fingers and press a little bit. Get closer to the belly button, get closer to the ridge. Yeah? Do you have that sense of like... Anybody else? Quickly before we get rid of it. Before we remove it. What does the spleen do, people? Transportation. What does that mean? What is it transporting? Fluids. Fluid. What kind of fluid? Oh. The ones that you get into your stomach. From your food to take in them. From your food, from what you drink, from fluid in the cells, in and out of the cells. What is the spiritual, esoteric soul? Spleen. Yeah. Yi. Yi. Did you feel it? Yeah. Like a kind of a ridges? Yes. Yeah, and bumps. Actually, somebody's removed it by just putting their hands on it already. Who was the last person? You. So you've already treated her. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> you want to sort of do that anti anti-clockwise. Anti-clockwise and winding, just think of it. Are we good? How deep are you going when you're doing that? Like uh, that's uh it's all it is. It's not like tween now. Can I see your tongue? Okay, what's changed? The colour. The colour. As so as the ridges, we're not going to get rid of those overnight because the whole body has to. Well, what changed? The phlegm? 
Is there any flag? Mm, no. What colour did it change to a frog? Right. Right. It feels, feels dry. Feels drier. I thought yeah. it was drier. You still have fluids there. Yeah. You don't dry. have, you had like a slight white coating. So already now something has kick started. How does that, how can that happen so fast? So you, treating the, the organ. We're treating the organ with intention. So it's, yeah. it's a close to Qigong healing as you're going to get without studying Qigong healing. You have to understand the qualities of the organ to treat it. So the Hun is the etheric soul. It governs our dream state. It helps us sleep. It governs empathy. It deals with frustration, anger, emotional resentment, bitterness. It also has the elements of the gallbladder, which is that gall, the courage, the drive, the sergeant major, the general's decision making. We've all seen people in the supermarket that are standing there with a shopping going, which card will I use? And you're like, <laughs> so they can make a decision to do the shopping, but when it comes to paying the, you know, the range of Kellogg's cornflakes or whatever, and doesn't know which one they're going to pick because they can't make that immediate decision. Soldiers have a lot of goal, a lot of courage, because they have to make fast, like life-changing decisions, it's trained into them. Yeah. So, I think of the colour green, 